it. Right? And if they chew it, they soak with gin, they chew alone, they soak with water. What is the difference? Let me share the difference with us. When you soak with gin, it becomes stronger. More stronger than you think. That is what happens with bitter cola, ginger, and garlic. When you soak these three items with hot drink of your choice, and you leave it for, for 48 to 72 hours to ferment, it is a knockout. So, and these are for the people that they can control um, alcohol. Right? So it becomes a knockout. And this particular one is no go area for somebody that is not married. You see that? Now, when you bring and you mash all together and you soak with water, and you soak with water, right? Uh, please, next topic should be women should be women breast and what and uh, what you are to do to avoid uh, to avoid breast cancer <laughs> that's a very delicate one uh, I only have I don't have too much knowledge on that unless I just share my, my little knowledge I have on that but I'm not too too much into that. So, then when you soak with water and you leave it to ferment for 48 hours, please don't, don't take it to 72 hours. If you leave to ferment for 48 hours, you are going to get, what is it called? You are going to get a um, result. But let's be sincere to ourselves. The result the person that soaked with gene we get. If that person gets 90% result, the person that soaked with water might be getting like 70%. We are being, we're telling, we're telling ourselves the truth. You know why? Because hot is already hot. Then you are putting three things inside there. It's going to be hotter now. You know. But let's see. See. You bring it and prepare it the way I prepared it the first day. And you drink it. <laughs> you are going to get a almost, let me say, uh, 80% result that the person with heart will get. You know why? Because you brought it and you prepared it. You allowed it to sit for 30 minutes and you took it. I don't know if you get it. I'm going to try to prepare the way why they use a prepare. If you prepare the way I used to prepare it, you will enjoy it much more better. Eh? I'm being sincere to us. Now, the person that we chop, huh? the person, <laughs> share, share, share. I have shared to my bros in diaspora. All of them so far, we speak like this, my bros in Canada. Uh, yeah. Now, the person that will eat Biracola, eats garlic, it's ginger. The person is getting it right away. But at times, some people cannot stand garlic. And we could. So that is just it. So, please don't go and do alcohol if you can take it. Just make do with that particular one. You can take it.